Hi Iris. This is your weekly day by day tarot cards reading by M for the week beginning 19th of July 2021. I'm going to draw two cards per day for every day of this week. So Monday the 19th of July for you Iris. The Emperor. Tuesday Four of Pentacles. Ten of Cups Wednesday, Page of Pentacles Thursday, The Magician Friday, Ace of Swords Saturday, Seven of Swords Sunday, Queen of Wands, your influencing energy, it's energy that suits you very well, Fire Sign. Now, the Emperor on Monday with Six of Cups, Four of Pentacles with Ace of Cups, Ten of Cups with King of Pentacles, Page of Pentacles on Thursday with Four of Swords, The Magician with Four of Wands on Friday, Ace of Swords with a page of swords on Saturday and seven of swords on Sunday with a king of wands. Your influencing energy is a three of pentacles. Now, you might be busy, you were in fact busy with somebody who is this fire sign or your best friend. This is representative of your best friend. Somebody who's also Aries or Leo or Sagittarius person, okay, could be your as I said, your friend, your mother, your sister, your brother, could be anybody like that, but interacts with you in a friendly manner. It appears as your best friend, your mother, when it appears not with uh, that motherly instinct, but appears as your best friend. That's your environment. Could be that you, that is you, that you are showing yourself with, with your fire, with your enthusiasm, with your happiness, you know, this, this, uh, energy is rather enthusiastic, okay, rather joyful, full of ideas, you know, how, how to proceed, what to do, you know, that one, again, bubbled with ideas, always helpful, okay, that ideas are doable, it's, it's not like silly talking and, you know, it can may be a little bit of eccentric energy, okay, but still very useful, very friendly, very enjoyable, lovely one. Perhaps you were busy, okay, you were busy interacting with a person like that around something practical, okay, maybe around your home, how to paint, how to reconstruct. You were um, interested to, I don't know, to do something around your house, to decorate or to break this wall, open another door, make your home office. You know, with Three of Pentacles could be something like that because there is building there, maybe you or building something, reconstructing or doing things like that and this person is giving you quite good, quite useful advice. Could be that it's just you having plans in a, you know, what for, about the very same thing, about your building, about reconstructing or about your home office, could also be something like that. Um, could be that you are beginning something that is... Uh, New line of work, okay, Aries, maybe you were interested in something that you haven't done before. Um, it is kind of new skill, but you are very excited about it. Could also be something like that, just, just uh, before this week, that there is this new skill, new interest that you are showing, something that is very exciting, enticing you in fact because it's joyful, you know, and you are good at it. It is very practical, new skill that you are learning, perhaps. This person is maybe very supportive. Or, as I said, could also be that it's just your energy around that group of people, around that reconstruction in your building, um, around your new skill that you are learning, that you are very enthusiastic about, you see your future with this new career, with this new skill. Could also be something like that. Comes from last week, very important for you this week as well. Now, you do have the Emperor. Now, this energy of Queen of Wands, that fire energy, now with the Emperor, that is you, Aries, in your full power. Knowing exactly what you're supposed to do, that, that that's full authority, that's how you show yourself. 
could be somebody else, maybe your father, maybe something that is, um, I don't know, government authority, but I kind of felt it is all about you, that you are kind of changing something in your life and you are doing it with full authority, with full confidence, with full, with full understanding, okay, and joy and enthusiasm about how you're going to implement it, how much money you're going to make, what your life going to be from now on. Could also be something like that and I really felt that it is about you, you know, feeling good about changing something in your life. And this change perhaps is kind of changing structure in your life. You are changing your routine in a way. It's kind of will uh, kind of affects your life, day-to-day -day life, okay? You all kind of making structure for yourself. You're very optimistic about it. The six uh, of cups is this um, childlike energy that you have it in yourself. Though this is full power there with this emperor, maybe your father, because we always re uh, um, relate this energy to childhood, to children, that childlike in self. Okay, maybe. So, could be that it is your father and that you are very happy about this new beginning. Somebody is helping you, somebody who is authority and you do trust that person. Could also be something like that. But, uh, you know, on Monday you will feel good about yourself. You will be optimistic whether that is... Um, you like that, changing something in your life, bringing new structure in your life, um, happily, gladly, you know, will food with, with full confidence, or it's somebody else that is helping you, okay, maybe somebody um, that you know from your past comes back again in your life, in a comes big time then you know this person is very important i really want to believe that it is you that you are changing your structure in your life something day to day some routine you have to change i really believe it's something like that but as i said could be person that comes from from your past okay person that you know from your childhood could be your father or something like that on monday positive uh, uh change um in, in, um, in your everyday life that will affect you further on. This one, this energy will affect your life further on. It's not just for Monday. Now, Four of Pentacles and Ace of Cups on Tuesday. Now, Four of Pentacles, it's very stable energy. It is about your safety, your security. This is that amount of money that covers your bills, that uh, um, covers that your survival, okay? Money for food, for you know, for your rent, stuff like that. Being individual, covering your individuality, covering your independence. That what is about this safety, security, independence. But you are here sitting by yourself, okay, having just enough. Okay, in your environment, showing yourself, I've got enough. Number four, this is number four as well, very stable plateau. Uh, sometimes stagnant, but its stability for you at this point perhaps is important because you might actually, it, it, I kind of really felt that you are changing something in your life and that stability, that first stability is important for you. That first money that you received, okay, you are doing some, something that is new, very new for you and that first money that you receive, even if it's not big money, is very important. It gives you um, encouragement that you are on the right path. Just carry on. It will be bigger. It will be more. You see what I'm saying? Could also be some amount of money. And it is you are optimistic. You think that that will bring you happiness from now on. Okay, it's not going to be just security. It will be happiness as well. Your future is in that what you are doing. In that what you are changing right now. You are changing something and there is future future in it makes you very happy you do see uh, opportunity for yourself even though right now it's just that basic but it is a promise that you see in that for your future okay now lovely ace of cups uh, followed by ten of cups they're just beautiful to have in your readings okay understanding that that emotional fulfillment is there Okay, that, that completion is there, that gratefulness that you have enough money, you do feel yourself as a business person, you feel yourself established here. 
okay, on Wednesday. And it is about your money making, about your career, being, being very confident that, that what you do is the right way forward, okay? Even at this point, it's just a beginning, but there is this uh, energy of happily ever after. That what you do, that business that you have, with this attitude, with this um, groundness and understanding, with this business mind, it can take you for, it will bring happiness, happiness, happily ever after, happiness from now on. You are looking into your happy life from now on. You see what I'm saying? Things like that. You are changing something that's supposed to make you happy, that's supposed to bring you money, that's supposed to bring you security. It's all about that some of these days. And I believe it's even from earlier on, somewhere from last week as well. Page of Pentacles with Four of Swords. Now, this is beginning, okay, being, being on the starting point with this idea about yourself. What are you going to do today? Okay, and it is very practical. This is currently what you're going to do. Maybe you do have idea this this uh, pentacle that this person is holding in its hand represents that practical goal, that practical thing that you are following, that you want to accomplish, that you want to achieve, that you want to learn. This one is learner. Okay, very young, very beginning of something. Yes, you're supposed to do that. Okay, being to become mechanic, to fix your core, but you have to learn, okay? You don't have enough knowledge, but you are following, you are very dedicated to that goal which you did put in front of yourself, all right? That is Page of Pentacles energy, very enthusiastic in a way, young, enthusiastic, brings change in your life. This is a new goal that you have and you are following to be like that person, you know, like Steven, or like somebody, you want to be like that engineer, like that computer programmer, or you want to you wanna do that particular job, you want to know how to make tiramisu cake, and you see what I'm saying, you're going to learn, you're going to, could be anything, you know, trivial, everyday things, it could be something major, your major goal that you put in front of yourself, because there is emperor there at the beginning, okay, beginning of this week, major structure that one covers. This is strong authority. But anyway, as I said, I'm sure you didn't understand me. For Thursday, you do have this practical goal. Practical, something you're supposed to do today, practically. You already, you are very eager to learn and to, okay, to achieve, to be like that, to learn that particular thing, to complete that task. Anyhow, Within you, you are with four of swords. Some way, some way you, you, um, you, you, you are searching for your clarity. There is, okay, things that you are doing and it's very practical and it is at the very beginning. I believe on this day you will, you will have to th uh, think, think things through. Okay, you have to find clarity for yourself about that what you have decided. Perhaps, perhaps that you are not sure about yourself, but perhaps you are sure about your goal, but you're not sure how to get there. Maybe something like that, but surely something with four of swords. It's a very uncomfortable situation for you here. It is your inner self, okay? Being uncomfortable, not being sure, am I making the right decision here? Okay, am I doing the right things? Is it the right path for me? You see what I'm saying? That kind of energy in here on Thursday for you. You will not show it in your environment. You will show yourself, okay, I'm on it. I'm on it. Okay, but you will have your doubts. You will need your clarity. You will need to be sure about yourself. Simple as that. And on these days, you just not. On, on this day, on Thursday, okay, you are just not. A bit different emotional state than, than, than Wednesday or maybe Tuesday. These are really beautiful days. Now here you are kind of a little bit uncomfortable with the things, with the way things are moving on. Okay, it kind of makes you a little bit uncomfortable. Um, anyway, Aries, on um, Friday, you have another four, okay? Now, I believe we have lots of fours in here. We do have um, the Emperor, number four. We have four of Pentacles, and then we have four of Swords, and now we have four of Wands. 
four is a very stable number, okay? Something that you can grow on, okay? Very earthy, very stable, okay? You can grow from here. This is a very successful chord, and I love it with magician, okay? Particularly after this indecisiveness. Now, four of wands is still stable. All these fours can, um, can maybe stagnate you, can pull you back. Not, uh, they don't pull you back, pardon me, but they, keep, they, can, they, um, they can keep you in one place. Okay, for number four, very stable, very grounded. It's uh, difficult to move on from there because it's quite nice. You have this first plot of success in here. You are happy for yourself. Everything is balanced. Look at this, two by two rods standing very firmly in the ground decorated with the flowers and fruits. You see what I'm saying? It's rather a beautiful moment. You achieved something. You succeed with something. It is first plateau of success, as I said, for this about this Four of Pentacles. First money, first stability that you felt. It's good. Now, this is first success. You do understand you did manage to achieve something, but it is first firm plateau of success. You can stand firmly on it and that can be starting point for something bigger because this is also like a gate that you can go through into more, into bigger. You know, like you you do, you, you finish your, your um, primary school. Like that's your first plateau of success. And you now, we are you happy with yourself? Primary school is done or high school is done, but there's university still waiting for you. There's college or something. You see what I'm saying? Upgrade, go for more, more success, things like that with four of uh, wands. But by all means, successful card. It's, it's um, something worth celebrating. And magician says you are at the beginning. Finally, perhaps you did have some doubts in here. You felt a bit... Um, Maybe, maybe too much as a junior, maybe too much at the beginning, you know, maybe that was a bit discouraging for you, Aries, in here, uh, because you were at the beginning, it is still something to learn, okay, three of pentacles, it's a beginning, it's young energy, this one as well, being at the very beginning with this young energy, a lot to learn, it's promising, but still lots, lot to learn, lot to know, a lot to go through, you know, before you achieve something, but you are ready in here. By Friday, you are definitely ready, Aries. Magician energy suits you very well. Being at the beginning, feeling very confident. You were confident this week yourself. Maybe some sort, some doubts on Thursday, but you are overgrowing it very quickly. You do understand, yes, there is a success, you know, very beginning, but success nonetheless, and it is number one. It is a beginning for sure. It's a lot to do. You are confident that you can do. You do have your ideas. You can manifest in this life with that what you have started. Um, I don't know, perhaps somewhere last week. You can manifest in an exceptional way with that. There is opening for you with this magician. There is number one, you are on the starting point for something really prosperous and you are confident about it. Very nice, lovely Friday. I really like this Friday. Now, Ace of Swords, another Ace, okay? Now with Page of Swords. Page of Swords, it's change of mind. You will change mind about, I don't know, maybe these doubts that you used to have with this Page of Pentacles, which is rather slowish energy. Now, this one is a clear mind, okay? That's news, that's understanding what you thought earlier, that it's maybe difficult, um, maybe a long road, maybe too much to learn or so. You are changing your mind and you are very optimistic. You are very, you have very clear mind in here. Ace of Swords, your mind is brilliant. It shines in here. Your ideas your understanding, everything is truthful in here. Now you know for sure, okay? If you did have doubts around and you were not sure, now you are sure. Now there's no doubts. Now you know. Look, this magician is holding this idea, this, this wand high up in the air. Now page of swords is holding this swords high up in the air. 
this idea and this understanding. Okay, this mind is clear. It's a very lovely Saturday. I think everything from Friday on, everything is clear to you. That what you do, that change that you made in your life, I really believe that you have started somewhere, somewhere last week, is, you know, you are implementing it. It's supposed to make you happy and you are very clear about it. Your mind is really clear about it. Beautiful. I love this king of wands within you. It is you, Aries, when you are very enthusiastic about something that you can create. This is absolute creator. This is very creative energy. Doesn't have fear at all. Okay, very creative. You know, with emperor there that to solidify, to understand, to put structure, to, to bring authority into the matter. You see what I'm saying? I think this week is just beautiful for you, moves you forward, changes something. Um, something that is very new that you, I don't know, began doing somewhere last week. And it goes well, it seems you will carry on with that because this energy of magician, it seems to me, will take you further. These things will stay. That what you do this week will stay. You will, uh, um, you will do this practical. I think we all the time, we are talking about something practical. You will create, you will manifest in the outer world with the, this idea, okay? With that what you do practically this week, you will be manifesting. You are perfect creator this week, Aries. You will do that what is on your mind, that idea that you have about yourself, about your, your building, about your life, about your career, you will implement this week. You will put solid foundation, okay, for something new. That's definitely something very practical, whatever that you do, but it's a foundation, and that what you do this week will stay with you. You will know how to. That will be your hobby, could be your profession, it will be some uh, permanent change, in, on, on your flat, in your home, you see what I'm saying? Something like that, it will stay. You are creating, you are very optimistic, very confident about it, very accountable energy with a king of wands. Now, seven of swords in your environment, it seems to me, this energy, it's kind of a little bit problematic, like you are leaving something behind and, and you don't want to explain yourself, something that you really didn't like anymore because this is war zone behind this person and you didn't like that, that situation previous. And now you've got possibility, it seems you are going with something new and you are leaving it behind, but you don't want to explain yourself, you don't want to go down there and face people and tell them, tell them Look, people, I'm not going to do that anymore. I'm not going to be with you anymore. I'm not going to... I'll resign and I'll stay here another couple of months because contract says that. You don't want even to do that. You want immediate resignation. You see what I'm saying with this one? Leave it behind forever and, you know, kind of immediately go for something else. And quietly, if you can catch somehow back door so nobody knows... It, this energy, something like that, goes with this one on Sunday. I, I don't know, you kind of, I feel that you are so happy with yourself, okay? So confident that you are creating something new. That on Sunday, you, you, you won't, you wouldn't, you won't feel like explaining anything to people, like meeting them, yeah, like, like being surrounded with people. Kind of, you don't like to be with people. <laughs> I don't know, if... Perhaps you might have some invitation for Sunday, okay? Somebody will call you, uh, let's go and have a drink, let's have lunch together. You will look for excuse, okay? You, you won't be with people because you are um, very much occupied with that what is happening this week. You are creating Aries. You are creating something this week, something different. Um, I really believe it's your career, it's your money, okay? Something practical. You are very much on it. 
lovely i kind of like it uh, it's all your energies are present in here it's, it it says to me you you will be confident you will trust yourself and once you do aries you know that you can i don't know that you can create whatever is on your mind you can do it that's this energy that is that energy that's this one you see what i'm saying being confident that you can create whatever that you are on to this week you can do it enjoy it